Hello fellow duelists, this is Shadow of the Moon, and tonight I'm going to be showing you another episode of Two Card Combo, and this combo video is actually very special, because uh, I, this was from a viewer who actually did ask to show me how to pull off King Calamity using the pure Blackwing Synchro build, so I'm going to go ahead and do that right now, I'm going to show you, all you need is two Blackwing monsters, a Simoon, and then any other Blackwing that you want to in your hand, also, keep in mind, yes, I do realize that hand traps are a thing, and that obviously if someone has a hand trap, they're going to be able to stop you, but I at least wanted to showcase this off because it's very important to me, especially, and I wanted to actually show him how to actually play with the pure Blackwing Synchro build, so without any further ado, let's go ahead and get straight on into it. So, obviously, there's gonna you're going to discard your Simoon. This is going to banish it to act, play Black Whirlwind directly from your deck. You're going to play it. And yes, keep in mind, there's a glare right here. I'm going to do the best that I can to explain it. If any cards come over here and everything, but there's really nothing I'm able to do for that. But um, Black Wing Summon the Poison Wind, you're going to Normal Summon it. And this will allow you to add Sudri from your deck to your hand. So you're going to add Sudri. Then you're going to Normal Summon Sudri. You're going to activate Sudri's effect first. Chain Link 1, Chain Link 2, Black Feather War 1. This is going to add Vata. This is going to add Shamal from your deck to your hand. Then you're going to discard your Shamal to play your Black Feather Whirlwind. So you're going to play Black Feather Whirlwind right there. Then you're going to Special Summon Vata. You're going to activate Vata's effect, Tribute Vata to send Hamartan and Zephyrus the, uh, Zephyrus the Elite to the graveyard, which allows you to Synchro Summon for your copy of, where's he at? Black Wing Dragon. Okay, now you're going to activate Black Feather Whirlwind's effect. This is going to allow you to special summon Vata back to the field. And then you're going to bounce back Black Feather Whirlwind to your hand to special summon Zephyrus the Elite so you do not take the damage because you have Black Wing Dragon. You're going to replay Black Feather Whirlwind. So now you're going to send Vata and Sudri to the graveyard. This is going to let you synchro summon for your copy of... North, Northam the Starlight. You're gonna chain link one Northam, chain link two black, uh, chain link two black for the world, and chain link three, um, Shamal's effect. So basically, in chain junction, what you're gonna be wanting to do is you're going to special summon Vata using black for the world's effect. Activate chain link two's effect. Sudri, you're gonna or Shamal, you're gonna banish Shamal to add Sudri to your hand, and then you're gonna pay 800 life. You're gonna do 800 points of damage to your opponent. Then you're gonna normal summon Sudri, and you're gonna add Aroshi, and you're gonna add Chinook to from your deck to your hand. This is the most important card right here, Aroshi, that you can add to your hand because this is what makes the combo. So now you're gonna take Zephyros, and you're gonna take Sudri. And this is going to, or you're going to take Vata and Zephyros, and this is going to go into your copy of Boreas the Wicked Wind, okay? You're going to activate Boreas's effect, send Steam to the graveyard from your deck, making it a level 3. Then you're going to tribute Nothum to Starlight, and this is going to give you your first token, okay? So you have a level 2 token right here. Then you're going to tribute Simoon, and you're going to summon your Steam the Cloak back or to the front, to the graveyard. All right, so now you've got that. Then you're going to activate uh, Boreas the Wicked Wind, and you're going to send Sudri to the graveyard. This is going to allow you to go into your copy of Tamer Hawk Joe, okay? Tamer Hawk Joe's effect activates. You can now special summon back your copy of Boreas the Wicked Wind. And then you're going to take Steam and you're going to take Obsidian Tamer Hawk Joe. Send them to the graveyard for your copy of your Blackwing Form or Master. Okay, so now you have a token again. So now you've got two tokens. You've got the Steam token, you've got the Sudri token, and you've got the Steam token. Okay, I know I have scapegoats on that, but then you're going to special summon your Aroshi the Squall. Now you're going to send your tokens to the graveyard. Yes, your level two and your level one token to go into your copy of Sam Samsara Sorrow Sam Sara Sorrow Cat. And what makes this very, very important is uh, and yes, I do know I had to switch it, it's because I wanted to actually show you the card. Is that now what's gonna happen is on your opponent's turn when it's their main phase, as soon as they activate a card, you can activate the effect when you tribute this, this, and the Blackwing Dragon. 
this is going to allow you to go into your King Calamity. Now keep in mind, King Calamity is on the field. You cannot activate any other cards after that. If you activate any other cards act after that, it completely destroys, basically negates the effect. So now you have this on the field, you have this in your hand if you need it, and basically you have just shut down their entire play. They, it's like Kaliuga, they cannot activate cards or effects. So that is the best way to go through it. Um, if I missed anything, you know, please correct me, but I did the best that I could. Mainly the main card in the deck, obviously, is going to be Samsara Cat and then the rest of the Black Wings, so that's why it's a pure synchro build. This is just insane to be able to bring this out. Yes, you can use Burning Soul to use it, and there's another combo to go through that, but I don't know that one because I don't use Burning Soul in my pure synchro build. But yeah, so that's going to be this combo. I hope you enjoyed it. And with that, I'll see you guys next time. Later.